Hey guys, as you probably know, my name is Riz Grestar, and I am here with a quick update video for you. So the TLDR of this video is basically just, I don't know what the immediate future really holds for me, and so I can't confidently say that I'll be able to continue making Let's Play or Reaction videos. Um, there certainly might be a break, and there might be, like, I might just have to stop. I don't know. So technically, you guys could leave the video now. Uh, that's the update. Um, but to provide some more details on that, um, I have to go into just a little bit of personal stuff. So if you're interested, I guess bear with me. So I am what you might call lazy, among other things, like anxious and depression having and I'm confident and things like that and even in high school I never really wanted to have a job I always thought like I valued my time more than money and so I you know in high school I never worked um, and my first real job honestly was doing this it was YouTube it was making videos making let's play videos in particular on YouTube um, and for a while, I was able to move out, and I lived, um, not on my own, I had roommates, um, being my older brother in particular, um, and, you know, I was paying rent and everything, all that good adult stuff, uh, with the money that I was making from YouTube, from my channel, um, but unfortunately, that started to go downhill, I started to get less views, or fewer views, I suppose, I started to get less money coming in, um, you might recall the first time I opened up a Patreon, that was because the money that I was earning really started to decrease, you know, at the time, rent for me was like about 500 a month, and I was making about 500 a month from YouTube, and so, you know, Patreon helped me to, like, be able to still pay my rent, but also continue to build up a savings, that kind of thing, um, you know, and so, um, the unfortunate thing is that YouTube just kind of continued to go downhill for me, um, so, as a sort of, I don't want to say transparency, because this isn't anything bad, but just, like, more details, more information, um, at the peak of my YouTube career, I was making about, uh, 1200 a month on average, um, with like 1400 kind of being the high end and like around 800, 700 being the low end. Um, but you know, like 1200 was pretty average for me, um, as far as what I was making on a month to month basis. So that's when I moved out. That's when I was paying rent, living on my own, or not on my own, but away from home, away from my parents. Um, but yeah, now, like now, currently, I am making about $80 a month. So I went from making $1,200 a month to making $80 a month. Uh, so it's not great at the moment. And unfortunately, it's been like this for a long while now. It's just continually gone downhill. Like once it started going down from around the 1200 mark, you know, it started decreasing. Um, you know, again, like once I started a Patreon and that, like it never went back up. It's just been continually down. Uh, getting worse and worse. I've been making less and less money, etc. Um, and so I've I've been living at home. If you didn't know that, I've just been living at home with my mom and my siblings. Um, what changed a little bit was um, this last year. You know, the last summer. You might recall I had a summer internship, um, and so I went and did that. And the internship itself provided housing. Um, and after the internship, um, basically the thing was that the deal between the site director of like where the internship was held and my stepdad was that my stepdad would be a volunteer there like a full-time volunteer there and they would get to live in a house and that by the time they you know we moved out here to ohio where i currently live um they would have the basement finished for me so i could live there um a year later today the basement has not been touched they have not finished it let alone started to work on it and so instead I've been provided, like, a little two-room, like, you know, one bedroom, and then, like, a kitchen, dining, living room mix, and then bathroom, you know. Um, I've been provided that to stay in as long as I also volunteered my time at, you know, the same place I had the internship. Um, so that was never part of the deal, but, like, I went with it, you know, and so I've been volunteering there uh, for the past, you know, almost an entire year at this point. Um, but then, in one week's time... So, like, a, it's been a, I don't think quite a month since this, but in one week's time, my mom both told me that it was time to adult and, like, move out and get a real job and stuff like that. And, um, the landlord, the site director, said that I had to find new housing by 2020. Um, so, like, both of them at the same time, they supposedly weren't in cahoots or anything, they're, they're both kicking me out. So, the issue with that is that I don't know... 
anything about my future at this point in time, really. I'm trying to figure things out. I'm trying to figure out how I can go back to school and finish getting my bachelor's, because I was about to get it, but then, you know, we moved out to Georgia, and I waited for residency, and then right when we established residency, we moved out to Ohio, you know, all that. Um, so I'm trying to sort that out. I'm trying to sort out where I'm going to be living. Um, but considering I currently don't have a job and considering like I've applied to gas stations and grocery stores and fast food places and they've all rejected me, I'm just not confident that I can immediately get a job and such. And so I'm sure that I'm going to have to be, you know, like renting a place with multiple people in order to make costs small, you know? Um, so I just don't know if I'll have like the time and the means to keep recording i mean when i move out i i honestly won't even be able to bring my computer i'll be able to bring a laptop which is a good laptop you know it's it's a good gaming laptop um but it's certainly not as good as like my current computer my desktop that i'm using now um and i won't have you know like i won't have my lights i i might not have my webcam and microphone i haven't decided yet if i'm going to bring those along just because it's not looking super hopeful that i'll be able to start recording and doing things again, at least consistently, um, right away. I just don't, I just don't know where I'm going to be or what I'm going to be doing. I mean, like, if I, if my current plan works out, basically, I'm going to be going back to school, um, doing 18 credit hours a semester, and I think that if I do that within a year, I think I can get my bachelor's, and then hopefully people will look at my resume and think I'm worth something. Uh, that's, that's the hope. Um, but, you know, on top of that, on top of the 18 credit hours, you know, I, I just have to find a job somewhere doing something so I could make some money to keep affording rent and food and things like that. Uh, but, yeah, just the, the issue is I just don't know if I would have the time or the space, you know, reliably, consistently to keep making videos, you know, whether Let's Plays or reaction videos. Um... And, you know, I don't know, I don't know if I will start up again. Like, I just, I don't want to speak in absolutes. Like, I'm not saying that I think I won't, but I just can't say that I will because I, I certainly wouldn't have been able to tell you like a month ago that all this crap was going to happen. Um, so, yeah, I don't know, it's just a complicated point in my life at the moment. So, I want to reinforce the thought right now, if, if just in case, whatever, that this is not at all like a cry for help or anything. You know, I, I, I'm not asking you guys for anything, I'm just trying to explain the situation. If you guys did particularly want to help me in some manner, I mean, well, okay, not some manner, monetarily speaking, I do still have a Patreon. I don't, I don't offer any perks for it. It's literally just if you really want to help, you know, you are more than welcome to do so. I certainly do appreciate it. Um, but I, I do want to just restate that, like, th that's not at all what this video is about. I just, you know, there might be a really quiet period on my channel that literally could be like a year or more it, you know if i start back up again i just don't know um so i wanted to let you guys know that yeah i just i just want to do what i can to not have you guys in the dark um i do have some things recorded right now like i've i so i mean this might make sense depression and stuff has kicked in pretty badly recently um i said something about it on facebook um so it's been really hard to get to record like, get myself to record while I've been here and still had the opportunity. Um, but I have tried a little bit. You know, I did some more Mega Man. Uh, turns out, if you're already upset with yourself and life and everything, maybe playing a difficult game is not the best idea. Um, but I've recorded a little bit more of that. I haven't beaten it yet, but I've recorded some more. Um, I've recorded some more West of Loathing. Um, I mean, I guess that's really about it. Um, I'm gonna, you know, try to get myself to record some more, again, while I am still here and have my setup and everything. Um, but I don't know how much I'll be able to get done. And so, I'm hoping that during some of my absence, at least, I'll have some videos going up. Not, you know, definitely not on the same schedule now. You know, my schedule so far, I've been posting five videos a week about. Um, I definitely won't be able to do that. It might just be, like, one or two. Uh, but I don't want the channel to be completely silent you know so i think it would be better to like spread out what i do have i don't know and the thing is like who knows maybe i'll end up in a place real fast where i will be able to record consistently again and i could just you know immediately jump back into it um but i just i i don't know it seems like that wouldn't be the case but you know maybe um but just in case things don't work out that way uh now you guys are all caught up so yeah. 
So thank you guys for listening and for watching this video. I hope that it answered some questions, maybe alleviated some concerns or something like that. Motorcycle again. Um, I, I apologize that things aren't any more clear right now. Like, I'm still waiting to hear back about financial aid and stuff so I can figure out, you know, if schooling's even going to work and uh, what I can start doing, you know, as far as looking for housing and stuff is concerned. Um, so, yeah. Anyway, thank you guys again. I appreciate your support and everything. And with that, we're calling it here.